right, we are back, and there has been a lot of changes to Phantom Hysteria. They came out with their Halloween update, and there's lots of decorations everywhere, and sound effects, and all sorts of things. So, this is actually my first time playing the Halloween update since it was released. I have watched people play it, but I haven't played it myself. So, there are several things that have been added that I, like I said, have seen on other people's streams, but not in my own. So, let's see here. Go ahead and show some of that off real quick, or at least somewhat quickly. And then we will get into the game. There's also this. Let's see if I can trigger it. There we go. And that is one of the other content creators. So, lots, lots of things have been added, which I think is pretty dang cool. They also added a computer down here, and we have a training area, which has a bunch of things that you can check out and even try the gadgets and things like that. We have a little test subject, if you will, that you can try out different things on. For example, the thermometer. Oops. Where's Gage? Where are you? You don't want to talk to me? No? No, you don't you don't want to talk to me? Hmm? <laughs> test out this <laughs> well there you go test out the spirit box all kinds of goodies that you can try out that way you know what you're looking for whenever you go in game also if you pick up the uv flashlight you can see fingerprints again to know what they look like but there are also different hidden things that you can see such as this right here which is the names of the content creators for the game mine it's kind of hard to tell you exactly but it's basically on the left side far left and pretty close to the middle of the left edge so my name is there and there are tons of hidden things around the entire building, not just on this level, but also upstairs. But I leave some of that up to you to find. And we're going to get into some games now. There we go. Tuned. Let me find my cards, which I like to use physical and parasite. There we go. I do have plenty of ash 
but I'm pretty sure I have all of the cards. So that is basically just building up at this point. I'm just waiting to get that final card slot, which will be really nice. I also have, I believe, all of the gadgets, if I remember correctly. But I don't use really any of them except for the health packs. So I'm going to go with Yugo as per usual. If I'm playing solo, I always go with Yugo. But if I'm playing with the group, then I basically just go off of whoever is left after everyone else picks their character. So we're going to go with Cemetery because on the last video, I believe I did Bishop and Jones. So this time we'll do Cemetery and the Sanatorium. If I decide to do both, this one will be a longer video if I do both. So I'm not sure, but... That would be ideal if I could get through two of them and not take forever. <laughs> the fact that I haven't Me. done a Mary Shelley yet is absolutely heinous. Adjust my brightness. Like so. I'm gonna go check something. Oh wait, I don't think it matters. Or I don't know if it matters if I go in here first. But I'm gonna go in here. Because there is an Easter egg that I wanna see if I get, but it's highly unlikely that I will. I also don't know for sure where it's at. There's two spots that I think it could be in. I heard that we were right when we were over in this area. But we also checked another area because someone else was saying to go there. So it is also just highly unlikely that we will get said Easter egg. So I don't really expect to see anything even if I am in the right place. But I want to see if I'm going to see it. See, see what I can see. So, doesn't look like it's gonna happen. But what is happening is my audio is crackling, which I don't think affects things for y'all just for me all right don't think we're gonna see it so we're just going to go grab some equipment because i am not gonna sit there forever and look oh also let's see you might be able to see them better looks like we have jack-o-lanterns on top of some of the like pillars or whatever you want to call them. We also have Molly. Dang it. Okay. Grab those and this. Also, don't remember. Ooh. don't remember if I said in the last one or any of the videos I've made, but when you're playing solo, you can carry three items. When you're playing as a group, you can only carry two. Oops. I would hope if I press the right button. There we go. And I also think I heard Spirit Box, but she... being a pain in the ass, as always, so. Let's 
but we have the books down. I'm pretty sure we have spirit box, but I'm gonna wait one more time. Oops, I didn't realize I was still crouched. Good to know. <laughs> I didn't know until I walked up to that table. Oops. And then I was like, oh, oh, we have orbs. Which orbs in this game look, it's kind of hard to tell the color on here, but they look like blue bubbles. Oh my gosh. They also upped the difficulty since my last video. And I thought I clicked normal, but this never broke and she didn't come through. So now I'm not sure. I thought it was already on normal, but it does not appear that way. It appears we are on novice. Although she's not acting like we're on novice, but... <laughs> but the barrier is acting like we are on novice. Hi! No, we are not. Okay. We are on normal like I thought we were. Yes, yes, the Phantom Box said yes, we are on normal. <laughs> Whoop! Didn't see that go red, but... It sounded like it beeped. So I'm gonna double check that. I don't wanna assume. I'm gonna look for some fingerprints. Also, let me check the books while I'm thinking about it. Uh, yep, we have writing. There's a closer look for anyone who might have a hard time seeing that. Alright, nothing on the truck as of now. Sometimes I find fingerprints on these railings, although they can be anywhere. They can literally be anywhere, so. It's good to check all over the place because you never know where they could show up. Which, so far, I'm not seeing anything. Oops. Okay, I only saw a f oops, only saw a four with that. How's everyone doing? I hope y'all are having a, a great day or night or whatever it is for y'all. as well as a good week. If I'm getting this up today, like I hope, then it will be hump day or Wednesday uh, when, when this goes up, if it goes according to plan. Yeah, I'm still only getting a four. As far as I've seen, at least. Alright, I'm gonna walk around with the thermometer then. Yeah, we got freezing. Freezing. Yuma 5 or. Ow! Fucker. <laughs> EMF 5 or fingerprints. Is what we're looking for. So 
sometimes they're easier to see without the regular flashlight on. So I'm going to try with that off for a little bit at least. Oh, I thought I saw one, but I didn't. Am I? No. Okay. Making sure I'm not still crouched. Hey, we have fingerprints. Looks like we're spawning in totems, which is, means that that's what I'm going to have to find. And there's one right there. I always like to start by looking around the truck because I feel like they spawn there a lot. Okay, I don't see one. They can spawn in the equipment room as well. I don't usually see them in here, at least on this map, but they can, from what I've heard. Oh, I ran into the truck. <laughs> I see, yep, I was like, I think I see the mist around one of them. Or indicating one of them. And there are five that I have to find in the allotted time, which I think I see one in the distance. Yes, I do. There we go. Oh, there you are. I was like, where are you at? Alright, now I'm gonna go check in the center. How's my health? It's still fine. Because I've leveled up so much, I now regen health when I'm not actively fighting the ghost. The phantom, rather. And... Okay. Oops, I got myself turned around. There we go. This is the way I want to go. And if I don't find all of the totems in the amount of time I'm given, then I automatically lose. Which might happen, because I believe I have two more that I need to find. Yes, Molly is chasing after me. Ow. Oh, ankle biter. Okay, I'm not seeing any up here. <laughs> go. Where is... There we go. There it is! Where are you... Oh, I was like, where is she at? Oh. Health is still okay. 
as of right now that is. I don't actually see you. Oh, that was a great place to go, Shelby. Get yourself backed into a corner. could technically use my ability and steal some health from her. Normally it would go to me, but my health is okay right now, so like, I'm not sure if I want to do that, because then I won't be able to use it for a while, and I may need to. There you are. Slowly getting there. Woo! Walked right into her ult. For those of you watching that haven't seen any other playthroughs, if you think this is dark, just wait until you see the sanatorium because it is dark too and this is with my brightness turned all the way up which sanatorium will be with my brightness turned all the way up as well Woo! do i get some frequent flyer miles with this <laughs> thought i yep i was like i thought i heard her but i don't see her still don't actually see her i do now Actually, no, I don't. I see her ults, but not her. Health is still fine. You know what? I am gonna... Just so I can steal some health from her. Even if I don't necessarily need it, I might as well take it from her. Oh, how about I not get myself stuck again? Woo! There's a timer in the bottom left that will show... That shows how long until I can use my ability. I cannot see well enough to read it. I can only tell that it's there, but I can't actually... I mean, I could, like... If I focus solely on trying to read it, then I might be able to. But, I mean, I kind of... Need to focus on not getting killed. I can't just glance down there and be like, oh, I have 10 seconds left or whatever. I have to really focus to even have a chance of reading what it says. There we go. I don't feel cold anymore. There we go. There we go. So I've been adding a bunch of stuff for my streams to just add add a little little celebration factor to various events. So now I have it set up, if it runs properly, that is, to where different things like raids and subscribers and things like that Just will lights. trigger fireworks. So I haven't gotten to, or 
not haven't gotten to, but haven't streamed since I added that stuff because I added it last night. But I tested a lot and it looks like it works. So we'll see when it's in action. Okay, my cards are still good. Get my health packs and make sure we choose the right map. We are still on normal. And ready up. All right. Oh. No, come here. Oh. <laughs> All right. Whoops. Also, I don't remember if I've had it happen in any of my videos, but sometimes you will come down these stairs or down the pole and there will be blood everywhere. I always hope to see that whenever I come down here. Doesn't happen very often. I wish it would happen a little bit more often than it actually does, but it doesn't. But I was hoping knock, knock. for y'all to see it in Here's this video, but it didn't work out. So this is by default how dark it is on this map. I will show a little bit before I raise the brightness. I will turn the flashlight on though. <laughs> but now I'm going to raise the brightness because it is. Oh, never mind. That is with the brightness turned up. Okay. It seems even darker than last time I played, but. We have Molly again. All right. I just assumed that it wasn't the same gamma as I had it set to because the last time I played, the gamma was not saving. So I would have to reset it or like reselect it every time I would load into either a new map or back to headquarters. So I just assumed I would have to reset it, but I did not need to do that. This place is a maze and even though I've played this game and even this map a lot, I still get lost in here. Most of most of the time I'm playing on this map, I get lost. So. Also, I'm hoping that it runs okay, because this map often gives people trouble. In terms of computer performance. So, I'm hoping that that doesn't happen. But we shall see. Ooh. Almost back. There we go. She is hunting. And since I'm on normal and this barrier is broken, that means she can come right on in here, which I'm sure she's about to. Hi, where's Gage? Where's Gage? There she is. I was like, where is she? I know I hear her. All right, let me mark spirit box before I forget. And I'm gonna grab a flashlight. Might be too late to check for orbs after her disappearing, which it looks like it is. A 
that's when I try to take a picture to look for orbs is right after the phantom disappears. Sometimes I will look while they are actually hunting, especially if I'm in a group and they're not actively coming after me. Then I can take a picture and look for orbs right then. Okay, I don't see any. Wait, yeah, I do. Whoop! Yeah, we got orbs. We definitely have orbs. What is in the bottom? That doesn't look like an orb. <laughs> I mean, we have orbs, but that did not look like an orb. It looked white. Oh my goodness. Where are you at? I think I heard her right. I did. I heard her right in the book. Okay. Sweet, sweet. Would say we're not getting fingerprints, but just because I haven't found them yet does not mean necessarily that they won't happen. They still could very well happen. I also could very well have missed them or just not have looked in the right place yet. I would like to not fall in that hole that is right there. It hurts. Well, you hurt me too, so. You know, I don't really have much sympathy for that line, Molly. It hurts. Well, maybe not. Maybe you shouldn't be such a brat all the time. All right. I, oh, I didn't, I forgot I had my flashlight off. All right. That was the doorway I was meaning to look for. Earlier, not necessarily right then, but earlier, that was the doorway that I was wanting to look for. Oops. Might as well go grab an EMF. <clears throat> since I oops, since I have a free spot anyway. Molly Come here, you ankle biter. Yeah. You're flickering those lights. You can do better than that. Come on. There you go. Nope. Nope. I thought you had turned it off. But no, nope, not yet. All 
also on my stream now added a death counter so it'll count my deaths per game as well as total for all games i mean it doesn't count all of the ones that i added or all of the deaths that i had from before i added the death counter but or all of the games that i play off stream but it's just a fun little thing that i whoops that i added and i added timeout roulette because for some reason some people like like to be timed out on purpose whether it's through a game or just using channel points to time themselves out i i don't really understand that but some people like that so i have timeout roulette where they can do a command in chat and there's a chance that they get timed out for a few seconds. Molly! Oh, I hear you. Where are you coming from, though? <laughs> I was like, where are you? I did not hear freezing. Like, I didn't hear a beep during any of that. So, I'm thinking it might not be that. Three. I'm getting three at the most at the moment. Another three. Oh, I think she is hunting. Oh, oh, I think that was a five for like half a second. Three. And we're back to a one. But yeah, so I have added a lot. I'm trying to think of what else I've added since my last video and even since my last stream because I have oh, added several things. Nope, that's a four. There's the five. That is a strong five, my goodness. I thought about streaming tonight, but I do have to get up early. Unless I just stay up all night, but well, I mean, I guess I don't technically have to get up early, but I am helping my friend out with their charity stream. Actually, the same friend that I showed you their pets picture in the lobby. I oops, am helping them out with their charity stream, but it's at 8.30 in the morning, mm, so... I don't have a good history with being up at 8.30 in the morning, or like getting up by 8.30 in the morning, so that's why I'm like, do I want to risk going to sleep and not waking up on time, or do I just stay up all night? And then end up being tired during it, but at least I will be awake. Molly! I hear- oh, no. I was about to say I hear you, which I did. 
but then you disappeared. I'm sure that won't be for long though. Molly! Come here, you brat. Crushed goblin, ankle biter. You can do better than flicker in the lights. Come on now. I have not. Oops. Love how I switch off of my thermometer and then she's like, okay, now, now I'll do what you want. Because I was about to go look for fingerprints, but. Come on now! No, I thought I saw one. I thought I saw oops. Okay, I didn't hear any beeping, but that was a last minute change. So. Check up here. I haven't checked up here yet. Oh, nope. Is that all we're looking for? Fingerprints or freezing. Yes. That's what I thought. But I wanted to make sure. I haven't checked on these yet. I don't think it's going to be freezing, but I'm wrong a lot, so we shall see. Molly! I should help longer. <laughs> yeah, I'm not getting anything. Which, granted, I'm not seeing any fingerprints yet either, but... Those could be anywhere, so I could very easily just be looking in their own spot. Whoops. So, let's see. What have you all been up to? Do you all have any plans? for Halloween. Do y'all like Halloween? I mean, I know some people don't, which just baffles me, but I know some people do not like Halloween. I mean, I understand, like, if you don't like scary movies and stuff, although if you don't like scary stuff, then, I mean, probably not a good idea to be watching my channel. But, Even if you don't like scary movies, or scary things in general, I like seeing all the decorations and having an excuse to, you know, eat some junk food and not that I need an excuse, but, you know, I have 
Oops. An excuse, at least. Do I? No, it was already off. Try to check in here because I know I've seen people find them in here fairly often. So. That's why I was trying to make sure I checked in here. Well, that first round went fairly quickly, but this one. Not hearing any beeping at all. Um, why don't we switch out? Equipment here in a minute because I know sometimes it can be. Oops. Very good at hiding, are you? Now, I'm not trying to hide, but no, I'm not good at hiding. Why are you always alone? Well, oops. You act the way you like to act. It's not really surprising. You know what? You can sometimes get freezing when they're not visible. So I'm gonna walk, oops, walk around. Although I say that she is coming, so. Whoops, whoops, oh my goodness, Shelby, could you do a little bit better? <laughs> like, I know my vision is bad, but surely I can do a little bit better than that. Although, I will say, I have been misreading things a lot more than usual. <laughs> Like the other day, I was making a recipe, and the recipe wanted some soup, and it was calling for undiluted soup, because it was condensed soup, and it said undiluted. Uh, and I repeatedly read it as uncondensed, and I was confused and was like, uncondensed? Like, am I supposed to be, like, adding the things to the soup as if I was making it normally? Even though, like, I don't think that's what- I thought I heard it beep that time. But I didn't see it go red. Um. But yeah, I was like, I don't think that's what- you do like it's just a type of soup like diluted or undiluted so i was confused and i the amount of times like i i was since i was confused i kept rereading it the and i even at one point i even called my mom to like get her input because i was so confused um i was like what the heck am i supposed like like, why would I buy condensed soup just to uncondense it? Um, so, yeah, I was just super confused. So, I didn't know what else to do. My mom didn't answer because she was working. And so I was just like, well, I don't know what else to do. Like, I don't... Even if it's not saying add the ingredients as if you would make the soup normally. I don't know what else to do. 
So I just went ahead and added milk, which is what the soups called for was milk or water. And well, one of them, the cheddar cheese soup, I think specifically asked for milk. And then the other uh, cream of chicken soup called for either milk or water. And so I mostly use milk because the cheddar cheese soup only said to use milk. Um, so I added that and then I'm pretty sure I read it a few more times. At least one more time um, because I was trying to check the cook time to see how long it needed to be in the crock pot for. And at that point I finally read it and it said undiluted soup. And so I've been repeatedly reading it wrong. Yep, I'm not hearing beeping at all or seeing any red. Wait, Ugh. nope. Oh, down the stairs. No, I'm not good at hiding. You are correct in that. I'm not sure which one I should guess. Because I'm going to end up guessing wrong and she's going to be harder to get rid of. Oh, my flashlight. My regular flashlight was already. Um, but yeah, that wasn't even the only situation where that happened. There was something else. I was going for a job interview yesterday and I called the paratransit or the transportation specifically for disabled people in my area. And I called them the day before. This turns me on! You go that as a kid. <laughs> that that is that is gross. Um But yeah, so I I called them the day before to schedule my ride because you have to do it at least a day before by five PM. And so I went to do that and I told them the address and I don't know for sure, but I'm pretty sure I said 8,800. But then yesterday when I went to get an Uber, I realized it was 8,600 because I told them the address and they were like, that address like doesn't exist or yeah, they were just like, that address doesn't exist. And so they weren't able to take me. Which is why I think I read it as 8800. And again, I read it several times. And if I did say 8800, I'm just going to guess. But if I did say 8800, then... I I just I, I read it wrong so so many times if if that was the case which is frustrating statue fragments I think that says so it's just happening a lot lately I mean it isn't something I've never dealt with, but it's never been this bad, I don't think. So, it's just really frustrating. I don't know why it's gotten so bad. Oh, I thought that I saw a wing. Oh, that sounds weird down here. But, yeah, so it's it's been a little frustrating. I don't even remember why I got on this subject at this point because I've rambled so much about it. <laughs> thanks, thanks, Molly. Oh, we found a wing. Two more pieces.
Jerk. <laughs> not that, you know, not that she ever claims to be nice, but still, jerk. Whoop! Where's that wisp going? Like it went through the wall. Hey, there's another one. Another wing. Alright, I'm gonna go this way. So, like, I don't know if my vision is getting worse or what like i don't think that's what it is I, I highly doubt that's what it is but like if i'm just not paying attention i don't know i feel like i've been misreading stuff so much that like i don't feel like that's what the what's going on here but i don't know i I feel like that's more likely than my vision getting worse, but still, it's like, what is going on here? Thought I saw the body, but I did not. Um, we probably are not gonna find this before time runs out. And even if I do, I'm sure, I guess, wait! No, I didn't. Oh. Uh, I'm sure I guessed wrong. Either way, where is that going? This way. Ah, I found it! see her at this point. There's where I'm looking for. Might as well go ahead and use that. she's regenerating her health or not. I don't think so, but I would assume she is, because I highly doubt I guessed correctly. Oh, you hurt me too. Prime example. Prime example. She's freaking out somewhere. This is gonna be such a long video with me wandering around at the beginning and then taking forever with this. It's gonna be a lot longer than I had intended it to be. Oh, there she is. 
charge fuck I was like, I heard her somewhere, but I didn't see her. Whoop! Trying not to fall down the hole, ideally. Well, main focus is trying not to die. <laughs> but also, trying not to fall down the hole. Not a good round. Oh well. <laughs> I did it at least. Got some more experience. But that is going to be it for this video. It already went on a lot longer than I intended it to go. Hey, anyone needs me? I'll be in my log Especially if I don't edit out a lot of the Easter eggs that I was showing in the basement of headquarters. So I'm going to go ahead and end it here. But thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know I enjoyed making it. One more pet for Harold, <laughs> sort of, before I go. But all of that being said, I will see y'all in my next one. Bye!